Um, I know I was supposed to do a weigh-in video earlier this week, and I didn't get to it, so I'm doing it today. Um, I'm actually not thrilled this week. I'm actually up a pound from last week, so I'm at 191, which I think I know why. I'm not 100% sure, but I think I know why. Um, from, what I, from what I'm reading and what I'm being told, uh, if you cut your calorie intake down too much, that your body will go into starvation mode, basically, and you won't lose weight initially. I mean, obviously, if you cut your calories out long enough, you're going to lose weight, right? But initially, you don't. And I think that's what I did, because I was doing the Flex Pro meals last week, and um, those were only like 400, between 400 and 600 each meal, and that's all I was eating, my one meal a day. Um, I wasn't hungry, so that's all I was eating. And I think I... I think I did more more harm than good. Um, you're really supposed to keep your calories up to a minimum of 1,000 a day. So, um, some people say 1,200 a day. So that's what I'm doing this week. Um, and I actually feel better. I have more energy. So take my word for it. Don't cut your calories down so low that you make yourself sick because it's not worth it. It really isn't. Um, I've had to force myself to eat more this week because um, I'm just not hungry. But... I need to keep my calories up, so I am. And and the interesting thing, and I do want to mention this because the interesting thing is, I ate a lot of carbs this week, and I think I mentioned in last week's video that every time I ate carbs, like more than 20 grams of carbs, that I was so tired after I ate that I just wanted to pass out. That's not true anymore. I had a lot of carbs twice this week and I expected when I ate them I expected oh great I'll be going to bed early tonight because I'm going to be exhausted but that's not what happened I actually felt fine um, I had a little dip in energy right after I ate but then it came right back up so I don't know if that means that my body is finally fat adjusted fat burning adjusted where it burns the fat and um, it knows to do that I don't know if that's what's going on but I'll keep an eye on it and let you know. But I feel great. Um, and I do think that eating, I'm, I'm trying to keep it at 1,000 calories a day is making a big difference. So if you're like me and you're just not hungry when it comes time to eat, um, I, I take my one hour because, you know, I'm doing OMAD, right? One meal a day. So I allow myself one hour to eat. So I'll eat the first half hour and then I'll I, you know like 10 minutes it'll take me to eat and then I'll wait 20 minutes to a half an hour and then I'll eat again so I'm eating out, out my entire meal within one hour but it helps me to spread it out a little bit because then I can eat more um, I never in my wildest imagination thought um, that I would have a problem eating enough food in one sitting <laughs> that is um, very very weird to me because Obviously, I didn't gain weight by not eating. Hello. So so it's a really, really, really strange thing for me right now to be going through wherein I, I really have a hard time eating. It's so weird. So weird. Anyways, <laughs> I'm working on it and I'm getting better. So I've been a lot more active this week too because I think I mentioned I'm going to Nevada. Well, I leave tomorrow. Oh my gosh. So much to do. Well, actually, not so much to do. I got everything done. But it's been a busy week. Um, I leave tomorrow, I'll be gone for a few months, probably four months, something like that, four or five months. Um, and uh, But I'll keep you posted while I'm out there too, and I'll continue doing videos, because we are in this together, so we're going to stay on this together. So whether I'm here in Michigan or in Nevada, I will continue doing these videos, and I, w I really wish that... Um, that you guys would comment and tell us what you're doing and how you're doing and uh, did you did you experience that you've gained weight have you have you plateaued have you lost a lot let us know i mean i'm not doing this alone i I've, i i know i've got people that said they want to do this with me so share put on the comments here you know like the video of course if you like the video like the video um <laughs> subscribe and then put on the bottom that you know, and where's comments? What's going on with you? Are you guys losing weight? Are you doing keto and intermittent fasting? Are you doing intermittent fasting 16, 18, 20 hours? Are you doing OMAD? What are you doing and how is it working for you? And how long have you been doing it? 
And, you know, if you want to be real brave, you can put your starting weight and your end weight in the comments too, you know, or where you're at now so that we can, we can do this together and we can track each other's progress and, and do this as a support group for each other. Because that's really why I started doing this, because I wanted people in my age group that were going through this that could share, you know, the, the, the successes so that we can celebrate as well as the struggles and the challenges so we can help each other through them. So if you guys are having any problems or struggles or challenges, put them in there and I'll address them. I will, I promise. Um, and like I said, let, let's do this together. So let's track each other's progress and I'll, I'll, I'll even take it a step further. Um, and you can tell me in the comments if you want me to do this or not, but for those who lose lose the most each week, because let's do Monday weigh-ins. So every Monday, if you're doing this with me, every Monday in the comments when I post a video, you need to put in how much weight you lost or gained that week. And the person that loses the most each Monday or is the most consistent or however we want to do it, I'll say your name on the video. I, I don't know if that matters. If you would like that, if you wouldn't like that, let me know. Tell me in the comments, but I want us to do this together, okay? So I'll be flying out to Nevada tomorrow, so I will try and do a video on Monday. If it's not Monday, it'll be Tuesday because of all the moving stuff, you know, getting stuff done. So I will uh, keep you posted. Hopefully the way in this Monday goes better than last Monday because I wasn't real thrilled with a pound. I mean, it's no big deal, right? We fluctuate. That's what we do. But I still wasn't thrilled with it. Okay. <laughs> All right. Talk to you soon. Look, I'm really looking forward to those comments. Thanks, guys. Bye.